Hello, hello. Welcome to our ransomware proof of concept programming video. In this video, we're going to run through how you can build a very simple encryptor where it will take encryption or take a file and it will encrypt it much like what ransomware does now mind you be very very careful with this this is for educational purposes only do not use this for any illegal activity we're just using this to further understand how ransomware works so we got our proof of concept text file dot text here and it's in this uh, desktop uh, directory we'll write it out here soon but in part one of this ransomware series we're going to start building ransomware in c sharp c plus plus python but today's video is c sharp so make sure to hit that subscribe button and that like button to get alerted when the next ransomware videos get posted all right first things first we're going to start with uh, directory here and the way to do it in C sharp is the at symbol there and the directory to which that file POC dot text is on is right there don't forget the semicolon it's not python now we're going to have our text file what's our text file it is that poc.txt so we gotta put that in and in future videos we're actually going to illustrate how we can use the for loop to search for all kinds of files the text the doc x whatever the case may be so but for this purposes we're just doing something very simple getting our feet wet so we know exactly how it goes so in future videos we're gonna build upon these concepts and build some better stuff so in this we're going to be taking the encrypted file of course and putting it into um, the encrypted poc.txt we're almost done here we need to remember our key here and for purposes of this this is a very generic very simple it could be password could be anything but it's basically that key that will encrypt everything with this sharp AES crypt and you'll want to be able to get this via NuGet um, it's something that you do have to install and but it's pretty simple you just have to go up to tools and I can um, show in a future video if anyone's having any trouble with it but now we get to the fun part the actual encrypting of the file so it takes in as arguments our key or the password uh, that we're using for what would be used for decryption purposes and our encrypted file so text file then the encrypted file now if you utilize this all you're going to do is create a, another file because you can actually when you're encrypting it actually take in the file itself and replace it as a process what you need to do in order to make sure that it um, there's no extra copies of the unencrypted text file is delete it and then you're going to move it into so we have some file operations here but so basically if we didn't delete the file it would still be there we'd be basically what this sharp aes crypt does is makes a copy of it on the desktop and then you'd still have your regular dot text file there unencrypted so ransom layer of course needs to get rid of it in order to be able to work make their money apparently 
and that's what you need to do so this should do it remember it's going to be on this right here it's going to be taking our proof of concept please don't encrypt me and creating something totally different an encrypted version so let's go ahead and run it it'll take a few seconds here and but this is a very very simple process to be able to illustrate how someone can do it of course they're not going to be using it with the directory uh, they'll be doing some searches and so forth so let's go and check on our not quite yet all right let's check that out so what we see here is once we the console of course we it took our poc proof of concept dot text file that said please don't encrypt me and it got encrypted and so in our next videos we'll of course do the reverse and in further videos we are going to proceed with going even further into python c c++ to illustrate even additional ways of how ransomware works thanks again and don't forget to hit subscribe and that thumbs up button. Have a great one.